Hey there, Leo. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. This is going to be a general message. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If none of this hits home for you, just try a different message. Any information about personals, donations, merch, and more is in the description box below. Let's go ahead and get started. See what's coming through for Leo. Go slow. Take time to get to know each other. I'm hearing steady wins the race. Warning, don't dismiss the red flags here. Okay. This is definitely a warning not to rush things. We have retreat. Time alone or in nature will help you recharge. Okay. This is about dipping your toes in something, not just cannonball at the deep end of the pool, okay? <laughs> you might get kicked out if you do that. Let's see. I'm in love with you. My tears have healed my heart. This is really obvious. If this is a relationship, the faster it starts, the faster it stops, you guys. You have to take this nice and slow, whatever this is. There are so many things that this can be accounted for. Driving on the road. It's better to get there safe than be sorry. You know what I mean? Ladies, painting your nails. Let that shit dry before you go digging your hands in your purse and shit. You know what I mean? Like... There are so many ways that I could explain how this message is relevant in our world, but I think you get the point. So let's keep going, especially if this is in love and romance. Something that you really, really want here. Okay, so I have, I've been shopping for rings. I love our late night pillow talks. It turns me on. And the answer is yes. I'm going to try to fit all of this on. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to, but I'm going to try here. Did I get it? No. Close enough. It says the answer is yes. So don't rush this, guys. I, I don't know what else to say. Don't rush this. That's the only way you can screw this up is if you rush it. Something is guaranteed, but take it slow. Take your time. This is like enjoy being fiance or enjoy being boyfriend, girlfriend. Enjoy your time together before you rush to move in and get married and have children. And like you're not enjoying the little steps. That sounds, no offense, but a little bit immature. No, it sounds a lot immature. And I understand when you're just really, really interested in something and you know with all of your heart and soul that you want this. Let me just remind you, though, if the there's only one thing that's consistent, and that's change. People have agendas, and over time, those agendas change. So just be very, very mindful with this, you guys. If you move too fast, you'll start to like, you'll just kind of get to this point where you're not acknowledging the steps that you have made. You're not taking time to enjoy that, to celebrate that. It's always about what's next, what's next, what's next, what's next. Like you're not, you know what I mean? Like it's so important to celebrate the victories, to celebrate the wins and to not rush yourself on all the in-betweens. See what else we got here.
the lovers. See, that's what I was worried about, the Seven of Swords. There are some underlying wounds here that, yeah, that need to be healed. This is what I want. There, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. But what about all these other swords over here? We're only addressing these two. And look at how you're handling them. That's very dangerous. Somebody's going to get hurt. Two of Wands, Decisions, Decisions. What about these decisions for Leo? <clears throat> the Tower, that's what I'm talking about. Like, just be cautious, you guys. Just be very cautious moving forward. There's something here that's... I feel like there's a shakeup that's sneaking underneath the radar here. There is a tower moment that's behind the scenes, just a brewing away, and nobody's really paying attention because we're so focused on what we're moving forward with. I feel like I'm talking to somebody that's very young, um, could be a new adult, all right? Because... Um, Or maybe it's just been a long time since you've been in a relationship. We have the High Priestess here. Most intuitive card in the deck. Please trust your intuition at all times. And there's the fucking Five of Pentacles. Something is being lost here. Oops, sorry. For some of you, maybe your intuition was not necessarily able to pick up on something. And it's like, whoa, how did that happen? How did that get here? I have goosebumps everywhere my whole body right now is covered in goosebumps just please be careful don't move too fast don't rush this again if you're running late it's better to be late than to be sorry Accidents are bound to be happen. Mistakes will be made if you guys are not more cautious. I understand you want this. You want this so bad that nothing else is really focusing, but you really need to be paying attention to your peripheral right now because, like, there is shit going on that if you're not careful, that rug is going to come out from underneath the both of your asses. You know what I mean? And I don't want to see that. So... Gemini, Scorpio, Pisces on the board. I'm going to leave it here. I hope this message helps somebody. I love you guys and I'll see you soon. Until then, stay beautiful.